how many folks have ever done vision work, like creating a vision for your organization or creating a vision for yourself? Just ahead, some hands. Okay, so you know this to be true, that in the creation of a vision, what we're working towards, we're working towards imagining what is possible. So creating a vision is around creating possibility, dwelling in the land of possibility. And what we're looking at when we start to develop and create our balanced vision is we're looking at the combination of self, family, and career. Remember I talked about this earlier when we were developing our life theme. And it's very difficult to create a balanced vision if you are siloing out these areas for sake of simplicity. You're siloing out these areas in your life. If you have family, you have career, and you have self. And what happens when we put these into silos is we often feel like we're robbing from Peter to pay Paul. We feel like we're taking from family to be at work. And then we're taking from work to be with family. And oh yeah, what about me down here? So it's very difficult to create that vision if we're thinking in silos. What we want to do when we're looking at creating our balanced vision is looking at the combination of self, family, and career. And how do all those things fit together? As I mentioned earlier, we only have one life. We have our whole life. And how do those pieces fit? And when we get clear, when we start to, to imagine what that possibility is, we start to begin to create that vision. And we put that vision up on the shelf over here. And it creates a destination for us. And then we do something in a parallel path. We take an action whether small or large, every day that moves us in the direction towards that vision. Because time is going to go by anyway. You might as well be headed in the direction that you want to go. In the creation of the vision, one of the first fundamental steps is for our vision to be successful for us, it must be rooted in our priorities. It must stem from our priorities. And how many of you have ever found yourselves complaining? Never, never, ever, never. The interesting thing about complaints is this. If you start to think about your complaints, they're actually hidden requests. Often what you are complaining about, you are requesting. If you find yourself complaining about the fact that you never have enough time to do anything, the request is, you want more time. If you're mumbling under your breath and you're saying, if I have to unload this dishwasher one more time, someone's going to die, you know that your complaint, the request is, I really would like someone else to unload the dishwasher once in a while. Yeah? Why is this important? Well, often what we complain about the most we are requesting the most. What we are requesting the most is important to us. What is important to us are our priorities, and our balanced vision must be rooted in our priorities. Your vision is, is, is yours, belongs to you, should sing, should sing to you just as your, just as your theme did. Uh, just as with your theme, it can be helpful to place that vision somewhere where you can reflect upon it to keep you focused. And you know, I can tell you from the work that I've, I've done with others and my own personal example is that if you make this compelling for you and you put it out there and you post it somewhere where you can reflect on it, a funny thing happens. And I remember this particular instance where I had a very large uh, five-year vision, very large. And I kind of looked at it and went, who am I kidding? How am I going to get to this? But I didn't worry about the how. I just put it out and said, ideally, this is where I would like to be. And a funny thing happens, that when we set that intention, we do tend to take the action. And you will find that in one year or five years' time, that you will reach that destination, just as I did, and others that I've worked with have. So it's in that creation and believing in that possibility that you will make that happen. And I had a, a woman share with the group her, her balance vision in, a, in another workshop. 
And I want to share this with you because I think it is so eloquent. What she said was, my balanced vision is the following. I want to be excited to go to work every day, and I want to be excited to come home every day. <laughs>